there are gemstones that come from out of this world? You may be thinking of things like star sapphire or rainbow moonstone, but those gems are actually mined in places like Sri Lanka, Brazil, and Madagascar. JTV Jewelry Television, one of the world's leading jewelry and gemstone retailers, takes great pride in opening the world of jewelry and gemstones to everyone. And one of JTV's favorite celestial gems is called Moldavite. Many people here at Jewelry Television ask me why I love Moldavite. And it's, it's such a basic thing with me. There were only four instances in the history of the Earth where a meteorite large enough uh, hit the Earth with such force that molten material was flung up to the atmosphere about 15 or 17 miles and rained back down. Each one of those places that that happened, there are things called strewn fields where you can find that molten material that has now solidified. And so only one meteorite formed a green material, and that green material is what we know as Moldavite. The meteorite hit in Western Bavaria leaving what we now know as Germany's Nordlinger Ries crater. The heat and pressure of the impact, mixed with the elements in the Earth, created the perfect conditions to form this natural glass. Because of the force of that impact, these bits of glass were actually hurled as far as 341 kilometers, or 210 miles, from the site of the crater. Moldavite was discovered in 1786 in Bohemia, now the Czech Republic, and named for the Moldau River. This gemstone has a rich mossy green color and often has bubble inclusions, which are actually filled with air and gases trapped from 15 million years ago. How's that for a collector's item? Moldavite is a unique gemstone for jewelry and is a favorite with JTV customers, whether it's set in silver or gold. Another celestial gem that JTV customers love is moissanite. In 1893, mineral moissanite was discovered by Henri Moissan while examining rock samples from a meteor crater located in Canyon Diablo, Arizona. Moissan first mistook these crystals for diamonds, but years later, he identified them as silicon carbide. And although the crystals were beautiful, they were much too small to be used for jewelry. Fast forward 115 years to 1998. After years in the making, the first lab-created moissanite was introduced to the jewelry market. Lab-created moissanite has the exact same chemical and optical properties as the crystals left behind by that meteorite. And moissanite has a higher refractive index than a diamond, which gives it more fire meaning it displays more colors when dispersing light. And it has more scintillation, which means it has more sparkle. Moissanite is a fantastic choice for jewelry, as it can be more affordable than a diamond and is nearly as high on the Mohs hardness scale. And Moissanite Fire is one of JTV's top selling brands. It's all about the sparkle. Right? I mean, I think every woman, we are drawn to sparkle, whether it's in clothing, whether it's in jewelry, whether it's in accessories, home decor, we love the sparkle. Because there's no other jewel, no other gemstone that sparkles more than moissanite, how can you not wear it? Moissanite is special, I think, because it gives you that perfection. It is the most brilliant sparkling jewel, and what lady doesn't like sparkling <laughs> jewels? Simply put, Moissanite sparkles like the stars. So next time you're looking for a piece of jewelry that's out of this world, think celestial gems.